Now let's talk about good old Amber Heard. <laughs> All right, Amber Heard. Did you heard? Um, yeah, some more stuff. I mean, this is, you know, we kind of knew that she was going to probably put her, her and her side were going to push back against the verdict and push back against the whole thing. But this is what's happening right here. Judge rejects Amber Heard's request for a new trial against Johnny Depp. The judge who presided over the Johnny Depp Amber Heard defamation trial has denied Heard's legal team's motion for a mistrial in the case. Amber Heard's recent attempt to get a new trial in her case against Johnny Depp has been denied. Heard filed a motion of mistrial to be declared and a new trial ordered on the grounds that one of the jurors was not the person who was actually summoned during the trial. So they tried to find something in there when it came to the jurors. The actress lost a defamation uh, case against her filed by Depp in 2019 after she wrote an op-ed on blah, blah, blah. We already know that. And, uh, yeah, then there's a whole thing. After the trial, Heard's legal team filed a motion to have the case declared a mistrial with a new trial requested due to a juror mishap over a mixed-up last name. Despite the individual being vetted by the court and the legal teams of both parties, Judge Penny Asgarit, Rete, whatever the hell it is, the Fairfax Country, count, country? The Fairfax country or County uh, Judge who presided over the six-week-long trial, denied all the all of Heard's motions via deadline, stating that there is no evidence of fraud or wrongdoing. Both Heard and Depp's legal teams were given the jury list five days prior to the start date and had every opportunity to object prior to or during the trial, but did not. So the judge finalized the decision, saying... The juror was vetted, sat for the entire jury, deliberated, and reached a verdict. The only evidence before this court is that this juror and all jurors followed their oaths and court's instructions and orders. The, this court is bound by the competent decision of the jury. Womp womp. So, I mean, let's face it. If she won, then Johnny would be doing the same thing, right? Johnny's side would be doing the same thing. I mean, that's just the way it is nowadays. It seems like whoever loses goes, fraud, fraud, fraud. When it comes to elections, when it comes to everything, whatever side loses, the other th that side goes, fraud, there was fraud, something, fraud, fraud, mistrial. It's like, do we really want to go through that again? Do we want season two of Johnny Depp and Amber Heard? No, we don't. Some people do. A lot of people probably do. But we don't need another one, especially when, you know, the first season was like, what's happening here? You know, it was really bad. But so there you go. Not happening. And, uh, you know, I think she'll be all right. You know, she'll figure it out. She definitely will figure it out. But, uh, yeah, so no uh, no season two of uh, Depp Heard, if you were wondering. If you were looking forward to that, I'm sorry, but it's been canceled. Judge canceled it. And, uh, yeah, no season two, but I guess lifetime lifetime, they got the rights to the movie. If I heard that correctly, if I read that correctly, apparently if you're going to see like the little mini series, that's going to happen. It's not going to be on Hulu, not going to be on anything else. It's going to be on lifetime. I didn't even know a lifetime was still a fucking channel. Whew. I don't know. I'm like, that should be on Hulu, right? Do it. Like, you know, Pam and Tommy do something. I don't know. Shit. FX.